I'm Jack D. Jeanette, and um, I'm going to be doing a, a special group called Made in Chicago, featuring some Chicago legends, Henry Threadgill, Muhammad Richard Abrams, Roscoe Mitchell, another Chicago bassist, celloist, and guitar composer, Larry Gray, very incredible uh, musician. And uh, we'll be uh, performing some of the music from our ECM release called Made in Chicago and some new material. Also, 50th anniversary of the uh, AACM, the Association for the Advancement of Creative Musicians. So, uh, you know, there'll be lots of celebrations and things going on all year long. When I was like five, six years old, um, listening to my uncle's jazz records, and uh, his name was Roy Wood, and uh, he later on became uh, a jazz DJ. And through having access to those records, um, you know, I was able to listen to the the best, you know, the best of the jazz artists then. And I I started playing piano when I was five and uh, five or six, and. Um, kept it up into my teens and uh, eventually got into drums. And, uh, you know, uh, Muhal and Henry and uh, um, Joseph Jarman and Roscoe, uh, we were all around the same time. Uh, you know, there were other people, Alma Jamal, Eddie Harris, just to name a few, you know, Herbie Hancock, Tony Williams, you know, it's so. It goes on, you know, the list goes on, you know, Coltrane, Miles, anyway. Well, it was amazing. It was crazy. It was great. You know, we had, we had a ball, I mean, you know, playing with some of the best players around, you know. The quality of musicians was always, you know, very high with Miles, so, you know, we, uh, we were always excited, you know, looking forward to hitting the bandstand to see what the... Uh, where, where we could take the music or where the music could take us, which was incredible places. Newport has a, is a brand and has a history, historic, uh, so historically known for having great uh, artists, singers, and, you know, on the bill. And, uh, you know, it's always uh, great to be, uh, have a chance to play there. And along the long list of jazz legends that have uh, been there. L listening to, you know, us senior citizens playing music at, uh, you know, 200%. You know, everybody's still <coughs> got their faculties. And when we go up there and play, I mean, you know, they're all masters on their instrument, but we're all still searching and looking for new ways to write music, express music, to improvise with it. And there's that, there's that youthful enthusiasm that still we all have. And so that, I think, is inspiring to the musicians, the younger players, to say, oh, wow, you know, they can play like that, and then I want to play like that now. You know? So, you know, hopefully that... Uh, that dedication, the intensity, and the uh, passion. The passion is a great word.